Hey guys, back with another unbagging to do today. But before we do that, I went back and listened to my other videos. Now I don't usually do that because I don't like the sound of my own voice, but to me I think I sound a bit droney. Now what I've struggled with is feeling like I'm talking to myself, which is why I think I sound that way. So I apologise for that. And I'm going to try and sound a little bit more upbeat, shall we say? So here we go. This diamond painting, lost my words for a second, I ordered from Wish. Um, this is the picture. I fell in love with it the minute I saw it. It was cute. Lovely colours. Um, I'll go ahead and open it while I talk. I ordered it on the 23rd of November. Um, it had a delivery date of the 19th. But when I looked yesterday or the day before, no, the day before, they'd actually updated it to the 26th of December. Yet it arrived yesterday on the first date they gave me. So, am I the only one that can never seem to find the ends? There we go. Right, so it took 26 days to get here. Now, I only paid... £1.90 for this, that was with 8 postage because Wish charge postage. So I think it was about 3 90 it was £2 delivery I do believe. So there's the tool kit, the single placer, little piece of wax and the green boat with no cut out and a few bags. It's a 25 by 25. I'll turn it this way so you can see it. I'm trying the video from a different angle today as well. Okay. Oh. There's no grid lines on the canvas. Focus. But you can see on some of them where they're, they've been circled. So you can see where the drill's supposed to go. So the drill field looks quite clear. Oh, it looks super cute. And there's no rivers in it. There's no bubbles, no rivers. Yep, yeah, even down here it's perfect. I like it. Oh no. Now I watched somebody else on YouTube, I can't actually remember who it is, so please forgive me, who said about these plastic covers, if you get them accidentally on the canvas the wrong way up, they stick. And she wasn't wrong. So be really careful. There we go. Let's put this down before I make another mess. Now I did it again. There. Safe. Now. The symbols are all numbers and capital letters. So it should be pretty easy to read. Let's have a look at the drills. They're not DMC coded, they're just numbered. So, let's 
do a quick inventory, make sure we've got everything. Oh, that's a gorgeous blue. That must be on the butterfly. It's around, by the way, in case I didn't say, as you can see. Three, four. Wow, it's like a lilac, but I'm sorry for the noise. My cat's decided she wants to play. It's a bit like a lilac, but like a grey lilac, if that makes sense. That's lovely. So there's number one. There's three and four. Oh, purple. Look at that. That is Beautiful, if I can get it to, I think you can see it, three, four, five, six, there is a number seven. There it is. Sometimes I can't see for looking. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. So it's all there. The inventory is complete. They are all in separate little bags. They haven't come together. Which makes it easier. I don't know if any of you, when you've been ripping up apart the strips, you've actually ripped into one of the bags. I've done that a couple of times. And none of the drills are oily this time either. I had a couple in my last one. Now, I'm not sure about anyone else, but I tried putting them into a baby wipe, giving them a roll around in the baby wipe, which worked, but then I found I had a lot of trouble getting them back off the baby wipe and back into a pot or a tub or some sort of storage. If anyone's got any better ideas, feel free to leave me a comment. I'll give it a go. I've still got some others that need doing. I just didn't want to mess about with the baby wipe again. So yeah, one last look, 25 by 25. £1.90 without postage. Adorable. How could you not love that? So I'll put that to one side and I will just update you on this one. Now I haven't had a lot of time. My camera's backwards, I do apologise. I haven't had a lot of time to do this lately. I've done a fair amount. But I'm currently up to there. For those that know me, I don't this is a fairly new hobby for me. My other hobby, which is quite a major part of my life, is uh graph can making with crochet. So I haven't had a lot of time to spend on this, but I have noticed that I've got popping drills everywhere. I've heard a few people say that about hula cans. This one's been really bad for popping drills. You only have to touch some of them and they just fall off. And I spend half my time pushing them all back in. Other than that, I've enjoyed it. I do like the picture, it's coming out really nice. It's very colourful. And there's not much left to do now. But I have noticed this edge here is all wrinkled. I think they might have stretched the adhesive when they put it on, which has made the can canvas wrinkle. I don't know if ironing's going to help that. But I'll give it a go. So 
so yeah that's where I am with that one I haven't started my other two yet been tempted but I like to finish one thing before I start another generally so yeah there you go thanks for watching if you're not already hit the subscribe button hit the like button if you like the video and leave any comments or questions down below and I will answer them. Thanks guys. Bye.